A Venice man faces nine felonies tonight after detectives say they seized loaded weapons and drugs from his home. Sarasota County Sheriff's Office SWAT team and the Venice Police Department work together on this investigation. ABC 7's Christopher Brownlee joins us now live from Venice with the details. Christopher. Well, good evening, Scott. Inside that home, three rifles, at least one pistol, and 1,000 rounds of ammunition were found, and that was just the beginning. We have SWAT. We had gunfire. This is the moment the Sarasota Sheriff's Office and Venice Police arrested a man they've been watching for months. It's very strange to see men with machine guns and flak jackets and camouflage gear on your little island. For the last four months, the Venice Police have been watching this house on Bayshore Drive in Venice and one of its occupants, 54-year-old Ryan Hug. We've had complaints surrounding the house and from the house, but also just some of the cases that we've been investigating. When SWAT busted in, they found a treasure trove of drugs, methamphetamine, diazepam, and morphine, among others. Some of the drugs were hidden in secret compartments in an RV parked out front, which has since been taken away. Neighbors like Lori Smith said, this all came as quite a surprise. Never saw really any activity there except um, there were lots of, we called them toys. Those toys are the multiple cars, four-wheelers, and jet skis for the roughly four people who were living there. For this takedown, the Venice police called in backup. Heavy weapons involved, uh, drugs, uh, people coming and going out of the house, that, and uh, so it was very important to have uh, very well-trained uh, people with resources, and that would be the Sarasota County Sheriff's Office. Law enforcement is still investigating whether there was child prostitution happening in the house as well. So far, we're told there's no evidence to suggest it. And Ryan Hug was taken into custody by the Sarasota County Sheriff's Office on a $25,000 bond. Scott, back to you.